Alright, what's up guys? As always, welcome back to our life of Bell. Going up against Mario. Using still our old teams. Not my party team. And I'm gonna use the Absol team again. Um, I was really not finished with that team. I, Even though it did really well. Probably not versus this. Um, freaking Arceus. Nice. That's, that's what you want to see. Um, even, like, it did really well. I think it did only so well because the matchups allowed it to. And um, I kind of want to be in that spot again, honestly. <sighs> Arceus, however, is not something I want to say. Um, you know, they released it yesterday, and all of a sudden, Shaman and Arceus are being a common thing. More so Arceus. Uh, at least I'm with Archam. That's. You have no idea how great that works for me. That's. Um... You're gonna face ex wife, gotcha. That's not something you wanna do. I'm just saying. Probably forcing a switch here. I'm gonna go for Ice Crash in case he wants to attack me. I sure would have switched out. So I'm gonna try to maximize my damage. I sure just makes no sense. Who would stay in here? An Osseous player, that is. <laughs> Alright, so fuck off, gotcha. So, second game in a row where we just kinda. So guard jumped the door. Former Uber of Gen 4 is just, pff, just, just straight up shit. Um, nice to see how awful it is. Um, oh, you have my sash intact, which is going to be very helpful if I'm performing a healing witch with Mammoth Wine. Star Raptor. Oh, pff, now you're just baiting me. This is straight up bait. Um, yeah, intimidate is a thing though. Probably, probably that's not reckless. So, a lot of really, really legit miles here. Who who missed Gen... Or is it a defensive Sarepta? You know, I would be down with that. I've seen it in leagues, never in Wi-Fi for obvious reasons. But I have every chance of thinking he's gonna go for Brave Bird. Or Stealing, because that's a thing. Come on, Aussies player. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. The Asian Relic Hath is gonna deal with you head on. Come at me, buddy. Come at me. Do tell me your body's ready. Because Relican's body has been ready for 430 million years. That's right. Oh, that's... That's not gonna... That's not... I'm gonna show you the door. It's gonna show you the fucking door. Now get out. <laughs> Alright, so Chomp is out. Saraptor is out. I'm still trying mentally to deal with Arceus. Um, I don't believe Infernape wins versus Relicant. I think Close Combat is going to do a lot, but I have a hard time thinking it could kill. Just because of the massive amount of HP. See, Infernape do decide to come in, though. And it's shiny. A lot of legit spells there. I like that. Um, do I have a proper switch in that makes sense? Like I said, I am in a range where I think I can manage a hit. So, yeah, I guess I'm staying. Trying to summon this close combat. Really can't, no! Okay, that didn't work. <laughs> but... I got a Psychic, which is definitely gonna help. A neutral Moonblast, I think, would be alright, but... I, I, kinda, I kinda have to do it. I think just to get as much damage as possible in there. Plus, I get to snag whatever he got. Blaze, Technician, Blaze. So that's useless. Not the technician or Iron Fist would have helped either, but still. Right, buddy. Show me what you got. I have every reason to think you're scarfed. And if so, I'm going to have another problem. But if I can get my Focus Edge back on Mammoth Swine, maybe it's not that bad. It's way worse with Arceus. Did I really have to sack Relic Can? I wonder. I knew Close Combat was going to come, so why not switching God of War, right? I should, I should not... I should trade... I should not underestimate my opponent just because my opponent underestimated me, is what I'm trying to say. Does decide to switch out. Good play. Goes into... Yeah! So, I was saying Moonblast was going to be a thing. So why didn't I? <laughs> so that's not great. I'm gonna switch in RST, I think. Like, Absolute's not gonna be 
tremendous this game, but at the same time, if he goes for a knockoff, I should be able to stomach like that, right? Ice to crush whatever I should not be able to take, and if he has a low kick, then my journey ends here. Let's see, he goes for Night Slash, alright. Wow. Not very effective. Yeah, almost killed me though. Go for a play rough, hoping to survive another one of those. Should be. I think it's banded. Get the roll! No! <laughs> Okay. Hmm. It has to be bad. It's not gonna go for a U turn. Mainly to invite uh, Inferno back. Jump, jump. While Scissor is good, it's not perfect. I really like defensive scissor. Like the reason I avoid using it is because of how common it is and how effective it is. But at the same time, there is no doubt why it's so effective. So it, it is by far the best defogger. So he decides to stay in, which I I don't know about that. And yeah, that's a dead ass uh, Mevile. <laughs> don't agree with that play. Right, bringing Cascade. Basically, I do want to invite Infernape and try to uh, chop it. Let's see, what's monster left? There are the Arceus, the Infernape, and I think it's one more that for the life of me I can't remember. And Afro should be able to deal with. I shouldn't. I don't know anything about Arceus, but definitely Infernape should be able to summon at least one flare blitz or close combat. But if it goes for close combat, I'm pretty sure I kill him. Though Flare Bits, of course, uh, will him down a little bit, so... Who knows which one is the better play. Latias. Oh yeah. You. So... Yeah, an aggressive Volt Switch. Wanna see what he wants to do. Could just as well meet your Or meet your Beam. I mean, uh... Uh, Draco, which would do a significant chunk. This also means I really, 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 really uh, psychic. All right, I shouldn't do too much. Oh my god! Yeah, try to say that again. Elisa. Just depends on the switch up moves. How much will a Thunderbolt do? If he has it. Night Shard does not do well for me here. Yeah, so I need to feed him ice. Get some leftovers, hoping I am in a good enough range to survive a Thunderbolt. I'm not greedy enough to roost, I'll tell you guys that. Every reason to think he has to switch out. They usually carry Surf or Thunderbolt. Surf is definitely the better of the two. Let's see, switches out, goes into the Arceus, which is, you know, what we've been longing for. The Busted Mon. Oh my god. Only positive part I see is that. Uh, it is the normal one, so Focus Blast should be the play every time, maybe, possibly, I need to, and hoping that Judgment isn't killing me. Do protect the Focus Blast, come on, God of War! God of War! Oh, Jesus, I need to connect one more. <laughs> oh, Special Defense Decrease, great. Um, Will-O-Wisp, now oh, that's new. That's way new. But special defense degrees does mean that he can't recover off the damage. It also means my opponent need to gamble on 30% chair chair here. Do you switch out is a question. Will-O-Wisp. 
Now that's a thing. Versus Latias. I mean, I, I kind of just switch up moves to Moon Blast, I think. Ah, oh, deal with these monsters. <sighs> it's stressful because you don't expect Ubers, and when you face them, it always seems like a gamble to break them because you only get like one shot, and, and you're lucky if you get that one shot. Osseus is just on another level when it comes to like offensively viable, and I'm always scared of that. And I think most players should be like the damage output of legendaries are just they're supposed to be broken, you know, shifting the game as much as possible. Brings back Ladias, yeah, that sucks. And now I trace Levitates. So wait, I can't trace. That's cool. And we do connect the Focus Blast, which is incredibly helpful, even though it won't do any damage. Now, I am in no scenario where I would risk this. Right? So, bringing back Cascade, pretty much sacking it really versus this. I wonder what my opponent want to do. I think it's just going to go straight up for a Psychic. If he goes to Draco Meteor, that would have been incredible. Psychic again, it's going to kill, but... I have every reason to think he's locked into that. And you turn again, and he's going to lose his... Um, his Ladias. Or, if you want to allow... Um, his... Um, what do you call it? Um, Infernape. <laughs> to come in, which I think would always be the best play. Arceus definitely isn't. And u will do... Where I think Moonblast is in range. I should take that gamble. This time I will. All of a sudden, I can't help but feeling that uh, my freaking Trace God of War is on another level and is ripping through. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Right. Please tell me Moonblast is enough, stab and whatnot, please, yes! Legendary killer, there we go, nice. My body's ready. <coughs> Ish. <laughs> Here comes the Infernape. As stated before, I have every reason to think this guy is scoffed. And, uh... Flare Blitz, Blitz should be his best play. And if so, it, he might as well win. But at least I did some heavy work to get this to work. <laughs> My only play now is to see what he locks himself into and see if I can uh, wiggle through. Stone Edge, alright. And that's kills, of course it does. So, he might be sashed. Right? He's gotta be. Let's find out. No? No, he wasn't! He wasn't! Oh, shit! <laughs> Not even that. So Gardevoir is just feasting on this Uber team. Oh, wow. Sorry for being so silent. Like, the, the, the suspense for me is just killing it. It is 
it's so overwhelming to know that I actually might beat an Uber's team with, um, you know, the best of my abilities, honestly. Um, let's see, what moves you got? Psychic. Yeah, we're not impressing anybody today. So, I'm gonna wrap up the game with, um, I mean, it's, it's only fair that God will get the chance to, um, to wrap it up. Now, if ex my ex-wife is able to survive the psychic, which most of my wives are, um, the psychic power just isn't their thing. They're, they're, they, they have the mental health of uh, a, a sturdy swine, that is. Um, though not my ex-wife, of course. Of course it doesn't. Uh, like I said, most of them do, but not my ex. Just to speed things up, here we go. So, yeah, this was... Uh, Kind of interesting, like, just thinking about it, uh, no, <laughs> damn, Osseus is just so bulky, it is incredibly hard to whittle down, so my best power and abilities to beat it just wasn't necessarily in this team, but God of War got in that focus blast definitely helped. So that said, Mario, thanks so much for the game, hope you guys have been watching it, you did enjoy this, and I'll see you guys as always in our next video. Till then, take care everyone, right?